Hello and welcome. My name is Todd from Heavenly Tai Chi in Yoga and today we're doing a short guided meditation. I'm excited to bring you this session to you today because I recognize that meditation is one of those things that people sometimes find a bit challenging because it asks you to slow down. It asks you to relax as much as possible while still being alert. So in a meditative practice, we want to find a nice quiet space. We want to find a place that we feel comfortable with, that we feel has got good energy. Um, so that could be anywhere that you set up in your house, which is a frequent place that you can go to, which is a calming influence on you. Obviously, you can also do meditation outside, so down by the beach, um, in a nice park, find a nice quiet space. Look, at the end of the day, one of the things meditation recognises is that there's always going to be something going on, okay? There could be some noise that could be happening, maybe it's in other part of the house, maybe it's, it's something you can hear, hear the road going by, but in this meditative practice, we're asking you to slow down, we're asking you to focus on really nothing at all other than the breath. And if you feel your, your mind speeding up so fast and you just want to come back to the breath to give yourself a chance to recognize that this is where you need to be. This is where you need to be right now. Now I do meditation twice a day. First thing in the morning after I've done my yogic and tai chi practice and then I also do it in the evening after I've done my Tai Chi and yogi practice before I go to bed. So it's an amazing way to start the day because the meditative practice clears all sorts of thoughts that may be in your mind that are not serving you at this point in time. And at the end of the day, it's clearing all that information you've had that's come into you during the day and you'll get ready for an amazing sleep. So as I said, I do the start of the day and the end of the day. So let's get into the practice. So we start with our practice with a couple of key principles. We want a nice long spine. We want the shoulders back and down. We want the head nice and long. I'm sitting on a cushion here, but you can do a meditation on a chair. We just want to make sure we've got a nice long spine. So a cushion allows you to be upright. I've got my legs just lightly relaxed in front of me and crossed. Um, some people might, people might find it difficult to do this type of movement. You can just cross your legs if that feels easy. We're going to be here for about 10 or so minutes, so just feel like you get into a nice, comfortable position. If during the meditative practice you feel your legs falling to sleep on you, then you can just extend the leg out in front of you and then just come back to your, your, your practice when you feel a little bit more comfortable. So the start of our practice, we start with a couple of nice centering long breaths. Nice inhale and exhale, just to bring yourself into the room and into the practice. We're looking straight ahead. Now the meditative practice, you can either do it eyes open or eyes closed. I suggest you experiment and find what works for you. I do both. Because it can be a, both an internal and an external practice. So inhale, exhale. You should feel a sense of calm come over you as you're going through the extension and lengthening of your breath. Keep that spine nice and long. Don't slash forward. Now we're going to take our hands, we're going to extend them up to the sky. We go prayer pose above our head. And then we're going to draw the hands down through each of our energy centers. The crown, the third eye, the throat, the heart, the solar plexus, and the dantian, and the lower energy centers. And then we're going to open up our palms. And we're going to imagine we're holding a golden ball of energy between our palms. We're at the Dantian, which is three fingers below our belly button. And in each, 
each energy center then take a number of breaths this is a chakra based heart meditation probably anything unlike anything you've ever done before in your meditative practice now slowly bring up arms up to the solar plexus Still holding that golden ball of energy, or that fire between the palms, fire energy between the palms. And just let yourself relax. Let's focus your thought on the breath and on your heart. Now we'll open the palms, bring them open to the solar plexus. So just below, above the rib cage, right in the bony point below the breastbone. We're holding that energy between our palms. draw those palms up to the heart center and sometimes people feel different energy as you're moving your palms up through each of the energy centers you might notice something different about each of those energy centers you might feel an energy between your palms as each energy center expands. Now let's take the palms up to the throat center. So both palms facing in towards your throat, really at the base of the throat. Continuing that breath, breathing in and breathing out. Again, you might feel an energy around the throat center. Now let's take the palms up to the third eye. Third eye is just between the elbow eyebrows. Now we'll draw the palms together, back to prayer pose in front of your third eye, and then we'll draw them all the way back down, back down through the energy centers, and then we'll open the palms. And we'll rest the back of the hands on the knees. From here, we'll touch the thumb and the forefinger together, forefinger, in what we call the chin mudra, chin hand position, which is connecting both energy centers, the left side and the right side. Now, the tongue is on the roof of the mouth, and we're breathing in and out through our nose. This is our final resting meditation here. We'll be here for a number of breaths. If any thoughts come into your mind, just watch them and then let them go. Come back to your breath. If you want, you can check in with your body. If any areas, if 
feel a little bit of tension and send some nice love energy to those particular areas. Meditative practice is an important way of finding the space and time to slow down. Clear any blockages and for some to find some inspiration, to find a beautiful place that you can come to, you know that it's safe, you know that it's healing. And above all, it allows you to get in touch with yourself, to find your best you. One of the big challenges we have today is being okay with just being okay. This is why the meditative practice is so powerful. It is your chance to reset. It is your chance to relax. Your chance to take stock and find that place of calm that you have within yourself. The challenge is taking this moment be okay because you are okay feel the peacefulness wash over you feel yourself relaxing even more You still have a nice long spine. And you just feel so calm and peaceful. Continuing to breathe nice and long. Part of your breath sequence. You might feel the breath moving through the body, through the energy centers. The throat, the heart, the solar plexus. Let's start to go through our closing sequence. Let's open the palms. Let's draw both palms up to the heart center. And we're sending ourselves love and calming, peaceful energy. Feel the energy from your palms resonating 
throughout your whole body. Notice turn the palms outwards. Let's send that energy, that beautiful, calming, loving energy out to someone you know who is not feeling well. You want to send them supporting energy. Beautiful, calming energy from your heart to their heart. Send them this beautiful, calming, peaceful energy that you've cultivated in your meditative practice. And let them feel the energy. It's a beautiful thing to dedicate your practice to someone or something that you know is going through hard times and you want to share, share your light with the rest of the world. It truly can change your energy, your vibration and your thinking mind to a heart-based awareness. What we can all do when we come together with our meditation is pretty amazing. Now let's extend the palms out nice and wide draw them up above the head into our prayer posture and then we'll draw the energy down we're closing down our energy centers only letting the good into our life bring our palms down to our heart center to our solar plexus and we finish here with a beautiful bow and namaste namaste Just give you a moment before you come back into the world. A nice moment. Have you un let the legs relax now. I hope you enjoyed the practice with me today. If you want to get notified of more of these sessions, I also teach Tai Chi and yoga. So click subscribe. Click the notification button so you know when I post these videos. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the practice today. I know I have sharing with you. And I hope you take this as your daily meditative practice, something that you can come back to again and again and find peace and calm when the storm is raging around you. Have an amazing day. What a way to start your day. Have an amazing day, amazing week, and we'll see you next time. Thank you so much. Namaste.